Barnsley are starting to show encouraging signs as they look to strengthen their grip on a top-six finish this season under Daniel Stendel, the Tykes are unbeaten in their last six league games and are one of the form sides in League One this month and they are sure to be one of the favourites to be promoted by the end of this year's campaign. It's sure to be an interesting transfer window for Stendhal's side as they mount their challenge for an immediate return to the championship. Barnsley are currently sat fifth in the League One table and many supporters will be hoping that Stendhal can make additions to his squad to help aid their promotion bid this season. There won't be wholesale changes needed to be made for the Tykes, but there certainly will need to be some depth added to the squad as the games come thick and fast after January. But what transfer business should Barnsley be looking to conduct this month? Find out below. Sign Mark McNulty from Reading McNulty has made just four starts this season in Reading's league campaign, so it would come as no surprise to see him on the move. The Reading boss is aiming to clear out the so-called dead wood in the Royals squad and McNulty falls under that category, having failed to make the grade with Reading. The 26-year-old is a proven goal scorer in the lower leagues, having fired Coventry to promotion previously, and he will be keen to find himself regular game time in the near future. Barnsley could certainly benefit from adding depth to their attacking options. Loan out George Monker Monker has already been linked with a move away from Barnsley with Luton emerging as one of the favourites to strike a deal for the midfielder. The 25-year-old has only made 10 league starts, and has more yellow cards than he has goals, which just about sums up his performances this season. He could certainly benefit from a loan spell away from Oakwell in the near future, as he evidently is down the pecking order in Daniel Stendhal's side.